Here are three awesome Power Query tricks. The first one, when you're using the Excel.workbook function in that, if you write the second input as true, it is automatically going to take the first row of the data and promote it to the headers, and you would not have to write the promoted headers step. My second trick, if you have a really fat table with a lot of columns and you want to see all the values of all the columns just as once, rather than actually scrolling left and right in the Power Query screen, what you can do is you can click on the row header and that is going to create a record underneath in the preview and you can then take a look at all the column values at once. The third one is really awesome. Let's just say that you're trying to understand any particular function in Power Query, perhaps list.sum. What you can do is you can go to the formula bar. In the formula bar, just write equals to list.sum without adding any kind of brackets. If you commit on the formula and if you press enter, you're going to see the explanation and the documentation of the function. And you can read that documentation right there and then start using that within your query. By the way, the Black Friday sale is on. In case you're interested, my course is available for sale. I'll see you inside. Cheers.